We're very happy to be joined tonight by the magazine journalist uh, John Arundel, who actually spoke to Philip Seymour Hoffman at Sundance. Thank you for joining us. And I just want to ask you to take us through the entire interaction that you had with Philip Seymour Hoffman at Sundance. You know, describe his appearance, demeanor, and what he said to you. Well, Jane, I have to say it was one, probably one of the most bizarre incidents I've ever had with a celebrity because usually when we interview the celebrities, when they come through here in Washington, it's under very controlled circumstances, and we uh, speak to them through their agents and their publicists, and it's, um, there's not a whole lot that they really can say. But on this night, I, I, I think I got him at a very unguarded moment. Um, I would first want to say that I'm, I'm deeply saddened by this as a, as a father of two children. Um, it's extremely upsetting to, to, to see somebody that you, that you just adore so much and is your hero uh, act in the way that he did. I, I was um, out at one of those late night parties in, in uh, Sundance and I was talking to a gentleman at the bar and I didn't recognize him at all. He was wearing a floppy hat and um, I said, uh, what's your name? He said, oh, you don't recognize me. And after that, uh, he took the hat off, and I said, oh, you're, you're, uh, you're, um, you're Philip Seymour Hoffman. He said, yeah, and I'm a her heroin addict. And at that point, I was just dumbfounded. And um, he, uh, he said, bingo, you got my name, and, and off, off he went uh, in, into the night. Uh, and before he went off, he said, I'm in rehab. So he said he's in rehab. Well, first of all, that doesn't make sense because if you're in rehab, you're not at the Sundance Film Festival. Right. Um, well, he just got way, out of rehab. 